اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم I have seen Wafa Sultan interview on Al Jazeera channel in which he is using a very obnoxious and bad language against the Islam and our beloved Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. Wafa Sultan claimed that she is doctor but after listening her I realized she is patient herself and she need a psychiatrist doctor. Wafa Sultan is very clever woman she used two tools to attack on Islam first one is a horrible faith of Islamic scholar and the second one is a rejected ahadith which are totally opposite to the Quran which were written after the hundred of years later Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam death First we see here horrible mullah faith and then we see the false allegation of liar Wafa Sultan against our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Agar musliman hai to murtad ho gaya. Agar musliman hai to murtad ho gaya. Aur murtad ki saza ye hai ki usko qatl kar diya jaye. وہ یہ کہ مرتد کو قتل کی سزا دی جاتی ہے اسلام میں مرتد کی سزا قتل ہے اگر کوئی مسلمان غیر مسلمان بنتا ہے تو اس کی اگر وہ پروپگیٹ کرتا ہے اپنا ریلیجن نیا ریلیجن اٹ از ایز گڈ ایسٹ ریزن تو اسلام کے اندر سزائے موت ہے اور ان اسلامک کنٹری دا شیئر از ویری کلیئر اپوسٹیفی از ڈیلت ود دا ڈیتھ پینلٹی نو دا کوسچن ٹو دی ہوریبل مولاس ہیز دا ڈیتھ پینلٹی مینشن ان قران نو ویئر What the Quran says regarding the apostate in Islam? Quran says, "La ikraha fi din," that there is no compulsion in his religion. Surah Al-Baqarah, verse two hundred and fifty-five. Why this mullah says that apostasy dealt with death penalty? Even the Quran totally abolished this rule because. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said 1400 years before that these 14th century mullah will be worse creature under the sky and these mullah proved that according to various ahadith e mubarka amamadi had to come to save islam in the 14th century so hazrat mirza ghulam muhammad alaihi salatu wasalam claim Imam Mahdi and Masih Maud peace be upon him in 14th century in Qadian Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed alayhi salatu wassalam revived the peaceful theory of Islam which were presented by Hazrat Muhammad Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wasallam 14 years before Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed Qadiani alayhi salatu wassalam defined a very beautiful rule to to check the credibility of the ahadith that ahadith is right or wrong he says in his book itmamul hujjat page 295 ruhani khazain volume 8 that those ahadith which are totally opposite the holy quran reject them now here bafa sultan playing a technique to attack on islam and spoke those ahadith which are totally opposite the holy quran and these are the hadith which were written after the more than a hundred years after the death of hazrat muhammad mustafa sallallahu alaihi wa sallam his son was the qatala biha al sayyida asma bin bint marwan andama qatta'a atba'uhu jasadaha irban irban wa hiya turdi' tiflaha wal mushkila 'adu ilayhi yukabbirun fa qala لا يتناطح بها عنزان أنت تعرف أن الماعز تتناطح لأتفه الأسباب ولكن عند محمد قتل امرأة مرضعة سبب أتفه من أن يتناطح Bufa Sultan playing a technique here to attack on Islam she is using the those ahadith which are written after the 200 years after the death of sallallahu alayhi wasallam uh, these are available as hard kitab al al tabaqat uh, volume 2 page 30 and 31 but these are the ahadith which are totally 
totally opposite the holy Quran education. If we see the biography of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam regarding the Quran, so this even came in front of me that uh, when the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam went to the Taif to preach them, the Taif people uh, behave Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam in a very brutal way. And those people who used to insult the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and used to call them uh, a sheep man, and those people who were munafik, who who used to come to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and they used to say they are with them when they used to go to the kuffar Makkah, they, they told them they are with them. And on the day of Fatah Makkah, when the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam conquered the uh, Makkah city. So on this time, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam forgave all of them. All of them, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam did not take revenge any single person. Al Masih, Ramz Salam, lam yahmul sifan, lam yqta' raqba, lam yukfir insanan. Amma al mushkila fi al Islam. إذا عدنا إذا فعلنا كما فعل المسيحيون في القرون الوسطى وأردنا أن نعود إلى حياة محمد وأفعاله وأقواله سنكون في ورطة أكبر من الله اليوم وسننتهي بأسامة بن لادن وأمثاله أقرأ حياة محمد ماذا تجد فيها غزو وفا سلطان أجين جيوز داري داري لانجويج our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, and she said that Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam spent all of his life in war. Even the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam uh, fought with sword in defense only. She forgot the life of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He spent in Makkah, and he faced a lot of the brutality of these people. The Prophet Sultan gave the example of. Osama bin Laden that how the Osama bin Laden is doing terrorism but she forgot that Osama bin Laden is most wanted person in Muslim world as well as as in the rest of the world. One side, Mufa Sultan admires the uh, Jesus peace be upon him and other side she blame on our beloved Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him that our, our beloved Prophet Muhammad peace be upon spent all of his life in war with sword. I show you some clips where you realize what happened that Jesus peace be upon him army in past and what they are doing right now. Christian who thrown the bomb on Hiroshima and Nagasaki where the thousands of people have been killed. Hitler was a Catholic Christian. He killed a million of Jews in Germany. If we see now the current position what happened in Iraq how they treat the Iraqi prisoners in the jail, what happened in Guantanamo Bay, what happening in Afghanistan, is this what is doing the Jesus army, what are they doing the Jesus Christian peoples, how they are treating the brood in a brutal way to the Muslim peoples. Wafa Sultan continuously supporting the hate against the Muslim by attacking bullying over beloved, beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. One side she admired Jesus peace be upon other side she supporting hate which is totally opposite. Hate is main reason of violence and crime and the hate is the main reason of World War III because all nations hate each other and all nation is going towards the World War III. In the last, I pray to the God, save us, love for all, hate it for none. Thank you.